Hi everyone, Scott here. Webcams are hard to get right now. They're out there, you can still get them, but they're just not sitting on the shelves very often and you can't be that selective right now. Now I'm gonna show you what it's like to hot rod your GoPro Hero 8 action camera into a webcam. It wasn't designed to be one, but it does a great job when you set it up quite right for it. So I want you to check this out, stick around and see you soon. Hey everyone, Scott here, helping you take your video, photography, personal and professional computing needs to another level. Hey, if this is your first time to New Tech Old Toys, I'm glad you found it. And to everyone, a big welcome. So, working at home, studying from home, just computing from home, or maybe you get to go to the office and you just want that solution. This is your place, this is your channel. If you don't see something that you're interested in here, throw it in the comments, contact me. With all that said, stick around. There's something here for everyone. Okay, so now we're gonna take a look at downloading the firmware from GoPro's website. So we need to be able to download their new firmware to a SD card so we can flash the firmware inside the GoPro camera. So from the website, let's take a look here. Let's go up to the search bar, GoPro webcam. All right, and so we got the beta for Mac on 7-7-2020. Let's go back to where we were. Okay, so let's go up to the search bar and let's check for GoPro Hero 8 firmware. And it looks from here like we can see Hero 8 Black. We can click on that. Okay, so we have the latest release from August 27th, 2020 the Hero 8 Black V2.0. Let's look at these release notes. It also enables webcam mode. All right, enables display mod compatibility. Excellent, that's coming out any day. It came out a couple days ago. Should show up any day. Adds HyperSmooth 2.0 High and Boost to more video settings. Okay, so this firmware sounds like a winner. With webcam mode and desktop software, I want that firmware, the Black 2.0. So let's go there. Okay, so now we have the firmware released for Mac users and finally in beta for Windows. So this new 2.0 is clearly the most current as of August 27th. Of, oh, and this actually says August 12th. So update your camera using the GoPro app. Or other ways, update your camera manually. I want to update it manually. Okay, so power off your camera, open side door, remove battery to see your serial number. Okay, so we put our serial number in. Okay, download the update folder to your computer. Now that's exciting. We're finally gonna get the manual download for the version 2.0 firmware. One, download the update folder to your computer. We're doing that. Transfer the update file to your SD card. Okay, so let's do the download. All right, update done. So let's take a look at show in Finder. All right, and so here's our my GoPro micro SD card. The GoPro micro SD card is GoPro one. Let's bring the zip file over here. Awesome. Double click on that. We now have our update folder. There it is. 
Now the folder has to be named update and it has to be sitting on the root level of the SD card that you're going to put into the GoPro camera and it's going to automatically flash this into the camera. So there you have it. It has to be the firmware in here sitting in a folder named update on the root level of your micro SD card. Now let's go ahead and eject that micro SD card. Be sure your camera is powered off. Insert your micro SD card into your camera and power it on. Okay, exciting times. Charged battery. Firmware on chip. Energizing camera. All right, it's coming on. You can see that right there. Okay, on the front of it, it says one, two, check mark. Okay, looks like it just turned itself on. All right, so that was fast. Very nice, very, very nice. Let's plug it in and see how it works. So we've got the camera ready, now we need the GoPro webcam software. GoPro webcam software. Okay, so it's the GoPro webcam app or the GoPro webcam desktop utility. We'll download the GoPro webcam desktop utility. All right, so we'll just open it and run the installer. You're gonna have to restart your computer, but ba -da, da dum and then click, do the restart, and there you go. Basically, we click restart. For the sake of this video, I'm just going to continue down. It's already installed. I'm gonna go down to the launch pad. We're gonna go up to GoPro webcam, and there it is. And that's gonna open this up right here. We're gonna be able to see the preferences, 1080 or 720, of course we want 1080 for now until they give us 4K. I hear even more is coming with the new release. Well, here we go. We each have show preview. And there we are. You know, the GoPro is serving as a webcam. And how much better that is than the built-in MacBook 720p webcam. Not only is the, are the numbers better, but the quality of the optic is really nice. It captures a lot. So now that we have the preview open, notice that the GoPro webcam app now shows those added features. The pause webcam and the favored digital lenses. All right. Nice, so that's the linear. Now back to probably my best one for my little setup here in this little space, the narrow lens. Pretty good. Well, I hope you like what you see. I hope you find some value. Again, you know, smash a -roo, that like button, but especially that subscribe button. Keep it coming. There's plenty more coming your way. Stay tuned to New Tech Old Toys. Thank you.